see my wig right there that's what I'm wearing today I'm not gonna wear locks today I mean I could but I prefer a nice big fluffy poofy hair yes I know I look like a ghost all right so I'll show you what's going on in the back because I know you guys have questions I'm wearing this big poofy dress. I feel like I'm getting married all over again. <laughs> okay, so welcome back to our channel, guys. Yay! So, we're going to our first party for the summer. This one is the first one for the summer. And Kenny's inside getting ready. She just got showered. I already showered. I'm just gonna put on my makeup and um, then we're gonna go get dressed. This <coughs> is a part is the party that the boat cruise party that we go to every year. And that's this is also the boat cruise party that we saw each other for the first time on. Uh, we set we set eyes on each other for the first time on this boat cruise that we're going to. So we're getting dressed. You're gonna see, uh, guys listen, I know I posted a video recently of me doing my hair, getting locks, and in that video I did say that I'm tired of wigs, but I never said I was gonna stop wearing wigs. <laughs> I always said I'm tired of it, it's damaging my hairline, which is like thinned out, trying to recover it. So I give it a, a I give wig a break. Like I'm able to give it a longer break now that I have locks, rather than before when I had to be brushing and putting ponytails and stuff. So this is a better solution to my thinning problem, getting locks. But see my wig right there? That's what I'm wearing today. I'm not gonna wear locks today. I mean I could, but I prefer a nice big fluffy poofy hair. So that's what I'm wearing. I think it will match my dress perfectly. I'm wearing a big dress too, so. <laughs> All right, let's get started with my makeup. So this is my makeup drawer. These are all my stuff in here. And yeah, I have a whole lot of shit going on in here. I don't know how I find anything when I need it, but yeah, that's pretty much what it is. It has a mirror on it, so, you know. Yeah, anyway. I'm gonna moisturize my edges a little bit. I have this thing, it's supposed to be for uh, thinning hair, it's supposed to help. So, there you go. Cause I'm gonna have to put on a wig cap shortly. So Kenny's taking Shadow for a quick walk before she starts getting. Hi guys. I'm yes, there is the Kenny. You're gonna walk the dog? Yeah, okay. All right, don't mind the makeup, babe. Don't mind the makeup, guys, because under my chin is darker. And depending on where in my face I put it, it's usually not so, you know, not the best looking match, but when I'm done, <laughs> it'll look like it makes sense. Yeah. And don't mind my technique either because I'm not a makeup artist. I do my makeup how I feel like my makeup should be done. The most important thing is that it matches my chest when I'm done, like my chest and my face should have the same color, if you get the drift. Yeah. It's getting there. <laughs> I don't use highlighter. I just, my foundation is technically my highlighter. Let's just put it that way. So my foundation is my highlighter. So what I'll do after is contour the foundation. Since it's already acting and serving as a highlighter for my face. I 
I went to bed really early yesterday, like 7, 8, 7 p.m. Like, there's no time in history when I go to bed that early. But because I was up all day yesterday, I went to bed late the night before. I was super tired. So today I kind of feel rested. Normally I have these big old bags under my eyes and shit because I'm always staying up late, then off to work the next day and not getting enough rest ever. So you know how it is. Yeah, but I feel more rested. Yes, I know, I look like a ghost. But it's, it's, it's coming along just fine. Okay, so now I'm gonna put on my, my powder. This is a loose setting powder. Well, helps to set my makeup. helps to set my foundation and it does make me look even wider <laughs> but don't you mind that we're getting to the best part Now I'm gonna contour all this white stuff on my face to make it look a little bit more, you know, to my shade, pretty much. Yeah. So you can see it's starting to blend in nicely. The middle part of my face will still be this color because it's highlighted, technically supposed to be my highlighter. It's getting there. I put it on my neck because sometimes my neck is a little bit too light for my contour. I don't want it to show, so I just rub it down my neck to make it a little bit darker on my neck right here. See? Blends in nicely. Yeah. Next, I contour my nose. It looks much better, right? It still looks white, but after I put my setting spray on, it will tone it down. Oh, good lord. I'm supposed to put on eyelashes, but I don't know. I really don't know. So this is the eyelash that I had bought. It's very simple, it's not too much, it's not over the top, but yeah, that's what I'm planning to wear. And I'm planning to put on this. What? 
You did both? Good. What time is it, Kenny? I'll be done by 12.30. That's when we're leaving, 12.30. So she's always worried about me taking her home to get ready. No, but we've not had to go on, babe. So this is my luminous setting spray. And it's going all over. Mm -hmm. Help it along, help it along. See, it tones down the powdery look. So my skin tone looks more even with the powder and everything that I put on there earlier. Mm-hmm, yeah. So it's gonna give me that glowy, doughy look. Sometimes I think I put too much, but <laughs> yeah, it's okay. Almost. Not quite, but almost. Hmm. I could pretty much leave my eyebrows like that, but I won't. This is what I do. This is what I do for Kenny every day. And but it is what I do for you every day, babe. I shouldn't say it. You don't like to hear it. I suggested for her to get permanent brows like I did because I did it years ago and I still it still helps because I had no brows really I know some people put on their eye makeup first I put my line on last before foundation I put on my foundation first then my eye makeup I just need to make the other one match. that now for my eyeshadow I'm gonna wear a liquid eyeshadow pink <laughs> yeah I'm wearing pink eyeshadow pink liquid eyeshadow here it goes let's hope I don't mess up
because I'm getting older, my eyes tend to be a little bit more wrinkly at times. But it's all good. I can manage to put my stuff on without the issues. So I'm gonna wear this one. So I'm now I'm using powder eyeshadow just to kind of a darker type one. Yeah. Just to kind of blow the blur the edges a bit. Now that that's done, this it's time for the glitter and the glitz and the glamour. I have a litter, uh, a liquid glitter that I'm gonna use. So, Kenny's asking if a sponge is good for putting on your makeup. She's always used sponge. I don't know why. Huh? Oh, she always used her finger to put her on makeup. She just rubs it on like a cream. Done. I'm using black. Here's the thing. I always afraid to mess up my eyeliner at this point because it's like, what if I mess up? Then I'm gonna have to start all the fucking way over, like. Match guys, hallelujah! They match <laughs> now. I hate putting on lashes, but what time is it, Kenny? You know what? I don't think I'm gonna put on no damn lash. I'm just gonna put on my mascara because at this point, if I do, I'm probably gonna be late, so I won't. I'm just gonna put on some. I do it the opposite way. I never go wrong though, I never go wrong. If I do mess up, I, I can fix it. It's just that it's better not to mess up at all because you can try to fix it and spoil your foundation because you already set it, you already spray it, you already do all the good stuff to it. So you really don't want to like mess it up and then fix, try to fix it and spoil it. Yeah. Okay guys. Oh, finally that's over. Uh. I like to see my lips looking bigger. Huh. <laughs> ah. guys my makeup is done I'm not doing anything more to it it's complete
you see this one was rushing me and now look at this just look at this So I'll show you what's going on in the back because I know you guys have questions. I'll just brush it through real quick but as for this I had asked my daughter to pluck it for me I don't think she did wait can I buy you a tweezer real quick Chantel did not pluck my wig I've been waiting for you to do your eyebrows. I know, right? What is it? What time do you guys want to see? This. That? No, but we're going to shoot them. What time do you guys want to see those dress? Okay. I come like say, I don't know all about dancing and that. big up on yourself guys and thank you guys for watching listen we got down at that party and you don't want to miss it we okay will guys some clips we are ready party, but i'm not so fully fully ready don't forget ready. to subscribe to hit the notification well, my bell is done. My hair is and done. I look out for the next video i'm wearing the same poofy dress i feel like i'm getting married all over again